Tell me when it's oh, okay. <laughs> Hello friends, I'm Glenn A. Polin, editor of Head Age, and today I'm with Ryan Cunningham of Red Barn, and we're at the Tickner's Buyer Show in Independence Township, New Jersey. Now, I've learned from uh, checking out the, uh, the exhibit for Red Barn, they have a lot of products that are just new or recently released to the market. Uh, Brian, why don't you tell us some of these exciting products that you have in the displays? So, um, the Bully Slices is our number one selling bagged item, so we come out with three new flavors. Uh, we have a peanut butter, a vanilla, and a French toast. So when you're having breakfast, your dog can eat breakfast with you. Um, so we've always had them in the bags, and we just recently came out in the bulk. Uh, so for those people that want to try it without having to buy the whole bag. Uh, we've also uh, came out with uh, a new shank bone, which this is a double wall bone, which is for those aggressive chewers, um, it's going to be a longer lasting chew without the splintering of the regular bones. So. The aroma on these are incredible. Yeah. That the vanilla. You smell the cinnamon on the French Yeah, sauce. you really do. I mean, it's like, it is like breakfast, yeah. yeah. So now you said now, so the retailers that carry this, the, the, the pet owner can, they can buy one, they can try it out, one of each, you know, variety, instead of being forced to, to go right to the bag without knowing which one their animal is going to like the best. Right, right. Okay. Now take us over here. I see we have some uh, new flavors for your uh, canned products here. Yep. So we uh, just came out, the stews have been very successful. So we come out with three new flavors, which is uh, the trout the quail and the dove formulas. So these are more exotic proteins for those people that are looking for alternatives. And it is a stewed formula that makes great with the kibble as a topper, or you can feed it as a complete diet as well. Okay, and grain free? Yes, sir, yep, grain free. Okay. Now we'll go from there. I know you're known for the large, the three pound, you know, the larger size uh, right. sausages, but now, so we came out with some smaller uh, rolls. So these are a four ounce roll. Uh, this is our number one selling formula, which is the beef. Um, so the retail on something like this is going to be about a dollar forty nine, um, and they come in a nice display box. Really like this. cool. Yeah, really attractive. So it's to kind of get people to sample those. So we sell them all the way from a four pound, um, ten and a half ounce roll, all the way up to a four pound roll. And this is a complete diet, so it's not your, um, it's not just a treat, uh, but it can be used as a treat. It can also be shredded over the kibble. It can also be uh, used as a pill pocket to conceal the pills when you're giving your dog pills as well. And then, even, uh, yeah. and then you have the grain-free option, which seems, you know, seems to be a big people that are looking for alternatives with grain-free beef in the three-pound roll. So. Now you were telling me about these uh, products. Fetcher's braided ring. Right, so, so these are some newer items, newer. Uh, the first one, this is a seven inch flat bully weave. And what it is, it's uh, six strands versus the normal three strands that we do on our braids, uh, as well as the six inch super braid, which is uh, six strands uh, versus the normal three strands that we do. Uh, and then we also have uh, re reintroduced. What I like about this is that we actually slice the bully in half before we bake it, so it actually cuts down a lot on that odor uh, that you get from a bully stick. And then the last thing we have here, this is a new Fetcher braided ring. So what it is, it's actually esophagus. So it's a, it's got health benefits as well because it's all cartilage, it's great glucose. And it's put into a ring, so it's kind of an interactive treat as well as a beneficial treat. So um, Now I notice a trend that seems like with these time to go through these. It's not going to be like a quick, like a half hour or, you know, or less. These are a puzzle piece for them. We'll tear these apart 